to be doing my updated makeup collection for spring 2015. So I am doing this video because I cannot believe it, but I have hit 50,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel and I am literally in shock. Like when I started YouTube, I never ever imagined that I would get 50,000 subscribers. And now that I have, it feels so surreal to me. Like I literally cannot believe it. And as a big thank you, I wanted to do one of the most requested videos on my channel and that is an updated makeup collection. So I'm going to start off in my vanity type area because I've never really showed this part of my room before in a makeup collection but I thought I would because as I said I never have but I just wanted to quickly say that I'm not trying to brag or boast in any way shape or form I literally just want to show you how I keep my vanity and there was my hand and yeah let's just get started. So my vanity area is actually like made up by myself because I don't really have a big enough room to have a dressing table so I first of all just have an Ikea lac shelf and then I just got this plain mirror from B&M Bargains and I just put some Ikea fairy lights around it to make it look like a, I don't know, the ones you see in the movies, like those type of dressing tables. So then I have my dressing table chair which again is from Ikea and the pillow on that is also from Ikea. I just want to say sorry for that stroke of light going down it, it's pretty early on a Sunday morning right now so... Yeah, that's why there's a pretty much load of light coming in. On my dressing table, I have a skewer pot holding all of my brushes, a container, which is like acrylic from Amazon, holding all of my MAC lipsticks, an IKEA plant, and then a bowl full of all of my current favourite Lush products that I'm going to be using very soon. As you can see, I store my makeup in the very popular IKEA Alex 9 drawers, and I just have the white ones because I know they are being made into black as well but I have the white ones and then on top I just like to keep it pretty simple so I have my Ikea candle holder with the Yankee Candle Fireside Treats jar on top I have an Ikea tin plant pot painted white with an Ikea plant in and then I just have my skewer pot with my three benefit Benny Balms I have Posy Balm, Benny Balm and Lolly Balm first drawer is where I keep all of my face products. I like to have my drawers very organised so it goes face, eyes and lips so all of my face stuff is in this drawer. Start off down here in this corner so first of all I have my two bourgeois highlighters and bronzers and these are the chocolate ones and they are so good. I then have my two Benefit boxed blushes. I have the Rockatua and then I have number 10 which was sent to me by a lovely viewer and this is just a highlighter and a bronzing duo. I then have two MAC blushes. I have one in Frankly Scarlet and I have my other, if I can get it out, in Dolly Mix which is my absolute favourite. I then have two Milani blushes, one in Luminoso which is this one and then another one in like a darky brown shade. I then have two NYX blushes, one in, which one's this one, this is Coral Dream and then one in Rose Garden and then down here I just have two e.l.f. Um, palettes, I have the concealer palette and the blush and bronze here duo. I then have some just circular products, I have the NYC Smooth Skin Sunny Bronzer which is a really really good bronzer, I have the Clear Complexion Powder, the Balm Mary Luminizer. MUA Undress Your Skin Highlighter, Rimmel Match Perfection Blush and the Maybelline Fit Me Powder. Section over here I have my Too Faced Chocolate Soule Bronzer um, which is a sample. I then have some concealers but I also have my Benefit What's Up Highlighter on top. So for my concealers I just have the Maybelline Fit Me Match Perfection, Rimmel Wake Me Up and then I just have a mini Benefit Stay Don't Stray, a Fake Me, Fake, no not Fake Me Up, Fake Up and then I have about three collection concealers and one Makeup Revolution one which is actually probably my new favourite concealer, I absolutely love that concealer, it gives really good coverage and it's my new every section. One. So in my foundation section I have uh, Benefits Hello Flawless, MAC Studio Fix Fluid, L'Oreal The True Match, Maybelline Dream Flawless Nude which Lewis got me, Rimmel Stay Matte Bourjois Healthy Mix Serum, Rimmel Wake Me Up and a Maybelline Dream Pure Here BB. The back, I have some Maybelline products, I have an Instant Anti-Age Primer and a Dream Touch Blush, I then have Benefits Erase Paste which is an amazing concealer. I have four Benefit Tints, I have High Beam Posy Tint, Benny Tint and Lolly Tint. I have a Too Faced Sweetheart blush and then I have some balm products. I have the Hot Mama, the 
I think this is just the Bahama Mama, and then I have the Frat Boy, and then down here, which you can't really see, I have a Jelly Glow blush and a Maybelline blush, and then here I have a Sleek blush in rose gold and a Sleek contour kit. I have three Elf all over cover sticks, and these are basically just the blush sticks, and then back here I have some primers. I have the Professional, all three baby skins, and then back here I have more Professionals. I have that Gal by Benefit, Girl Meets Pearl by Benefit. Too Faced, Primed and Poreless and then back here I have a Rimmel Stay Matte Powder, a Sleek Blush by 3 in Pink Lemonade, a Naked Flushed in the Normal and then I have my Too Faced Beauty Wishes and Sweet Kisses Tin which is probably my favourite ever makeup purchase. It was £50 but definitely my favourite. into my eye drawer so first of all I have two wet and wild trios walking on eggshells and I'm not sweet as candy and then I have my mascara section so I have the brand new L'Oreal Superstar Mascara, Maybelline Lash Sensational, Benefits Roller Lash, uh, Bourjois Collection, Rimmel, more Maybelline, Benefits Their Real, Elf Wet Gloss, L'Oreal Miss Manga, Roller Lash, No Clumps, Big Eyes and The Rocket. I love my mascaras. As you can probably tell, they are my favourite makeup item along with concealer. Down here I have some liners and pencils. So I first of all just have the collection pencils, next number eye pencils, Benefits Their Real Push Up Liner, Collection Liner, Benefit Highbrow, Big Eyes Liner, a Sigma Inner Eye Corner Eyeliner, Collection Eyeshadow Pencil and a Elf Eyeliner. And then I just have my two Maybelline colour tattoos in pink gold and on and on bronze. Over here I have some primers. I just have a couple of e.l.f. ones. I love the e.l.f. eyelid primers. I have some Maybelline Brow Drama, May Benefit Speed Brow, Too Faced Shadow Insurance and the Urban Decay Primer Potion which again is one of my favourites along with the e.l.f. I have some palettes. So I have the two Naked Basics palettes and I love the Naked Basics. They're so compact and they'll probably be in a favourites video very soon. I absolutely love them. I then have two NYX palettes, one in Adorable and one in natural and then I have my three Urban Decay palettes and again as per usual my Naked 3 is my favourite. I love the Naked 3 for the spring and summer. I have a Milani eyebrow kit in light, a MUA single eyeshadow and a Sigma brown smudge pot which I absolutely love. They remind me of the old elf smudge pots and then back here I have I MUA Heaven and Earth palette, my Maybelline the Nudes palette, MUA Elysium palette, Sleek Oh So Special, no, Sleek the Storm palette, the Nude Tude by the Balm, Makeup by Mandy24 eyeshadow palette, the Naked on the Run eyeshadow palette, the Too Faced Bordeaux Eyes palette, and then behind here I have the Elf 100 Piece eyeshadow palette, and then I have my only single MAC eyeshadow, which is in Gleam, and I definitely want more MAC eyeshadows as well as paint pots because they look amazing. onto my lip drawer so first of all down here I have all of my baby lips which I have a crazy amount of I have some limited edition the whole electro and the whole normal range and I then have these limited edition ones and then in here I have two collection cream puffs I have three NYX butter glosses I have two Revlon lip butters a MAC lip glass and then under there I have two Too Faced minis I have a Maybelline what is this like a colour pop yeah this is a pop stick a wet and wild lipstick and three Maybelline Born Lippies which I'm just gonna leave there. Up here I have my favourite ever lipstick which is my YSL or Yves Saint Laurent lipstick and this is in the shade number 9 and oh my god I love it. I have my Too Faced Sexy Mother Pucker lipstick, three Baby Lips Doctor Rescues, my e.l.f. Um, lipsticks, two L'Oreal Collection Previa lipsticks in Liar and Julianne, three Rimmel Kate Moss lipsticks and this is actually one of my favourites, number 113, because I actually really like wearing nude colours. I then have a Too Faced Melted and I literally want bigger versions of these, I love them. And then down here I have 10 EOS lip balms and Strawberry Sorbet and Sweet Mint are my favourite. And then down here I just have a few lip liners but I don't really tend to use lip I liners. have these e.l.f. copies of the Stila lip glosses. I have five um, lip lacquers from Revlon. I have two Tiny Burr lip glosses. I actually have another one that a viewer sent me to my P.O. box. My P.O. box will be linked down below because I do have one of those now, so that's very exciting. Oh, I just realised I have another Tiny Burr lip gloss. I have a Benefit lip gloss, Maybelline Colour Drama one, 
Pretty Smart by The Balm, some Madame Glam lip glosses, some Sigma lip glosses and then I believe under here I just have a couple of random ones from random places and then back here I have some Benefit lip glosses, Nivea lip butters, Popcorn lip scrub from Lush, The Balm, The Balm? No, these are just like normal balmies and then the Soap and Glory Smooch Operator is my makeup collection for spring 2015 i want to say a massive thank you again for 50k honestly i don't know what i would do without you guys you have literally just made my life so much better and i've already had opportunities that i cannot believe are happening to me so thank you so much for everything you do make sure you give this video a huge thumbs up and comment down below your favorite makeup item in your collection and i'll see you soon bye Of the landslide